Uh, today's video is going to be about Little Peep's debut at his first festival in the United States. This is a very important day and a very special moment in Peep's creative timeline. Now the day would be September 8, 2017 in Anaheim, California at Angel Stadium. It would be day and night festival and this would be Peep's debut on a festival stage in the festival realm. He was very excited. Um, his overall happiness and excitement was overwhelming. If you've ever seen that footage of him backstage with Matt Ox and a couple other people, he just looks like he is glowing. He looks like he is the happiest he's ever been. He looks like he's just so excited to be where he is in that moment. He looks like he's really embracing it. He also had a very um, interesting set list. Looks like he handcrafted a perfect set list for this show. He would play Hellboy, Ben's Chuck, Beamer Boy, Brightside, You Said, Save That Shit, Drive By, Needle, Cry Baby, Star Shopping, and he would end off with Awful Things, which is a phenomenal set list. Peep really handcrafted a perfect set to really just nail this concert with. This show is just so critical to highlight. Um, the fact that it's Peep's first festival in the United States, Peep would only play three festivals in his short career, so it's critical that we highlight them. The first one would be Day and Night Festival, the second one would be the Reaperbahn Fest in Germany, and then his third final festival would be Rolling Loud 2017, which was headlined by Travis Scott, Lil Wayne, and Kodak Black. It's very important that we highlight this concert, this first festival show, this first appearance that Peep would make, because I think he really, really wanted to be here a lot sooner. I think Peep really wanted to get booked on festivals going forward. It would have been really interesting to see the kind of large venues and festivals and just crazy um, places he would have been playing in the very near future, because there were so many special things over the horizon. Peep was really on the verge of greatness. Um, it was just a beautiful thing to watch this unfold. He was really starting to end up where he should have been a lot sooner. I think the overall um, performance, it really just shows how excited and happy Peep was. His excitement really just bleeds into his performance. If you see any clips from this concert, um, if Peep sounds like he sounds any different in the sets because he's so excited, he's so happy, and he's not afraid to show it, he's not holding it back, it's really bleeding into his performance. It's a beautiful moment, and I think he picked a perfect set list. Now, the Day and Night Fest would also be um, billed with Trippy Red, Smoke Perp, and Little Pump, and it's showing you where Little Peep, how he is blooming how he's becoming a huge player in the game and how he's really making big waves in the industry. It would be very important moving forward that Peep would play at festivals more frequently and really display his craft in front of a larger audience. This is a very important day for Little Peep. Baby, I can make you that I can take you there with 